On Monday, February 12th, the faculty and students at John M. Stumbo Elementary mourned the loss of one of their own, Miss Vanessa Sloan. Sloan was an 8th grade math teacher who was the victim of an unfortunate accident that occurred last week. John M. Stumbo Principal Donna Robinson talks about Sloan's impact on the school and how they're coping with the news. It's a vital part of our school and uh, it's made a huge impact on our students and staff. So um, obviously with a, a tragic accident like this, we want to make sure that we have um, the people um, that can come in and help our staff and students deal with such a um, tragic event. So our district has sent in uh, multiple counselors from the other schools to work with our school counselor and um, our superintendent. I've been in talk, uh, contact with her since, you know, since we found out about the uh, accident. So we have multiple counselors here today that, are, um, that our kids are talking to. And um, later in the week, I know that we're going to have therapy dogs for the staff and students. Um, they've provided us, you know, lunch today. Just trying to um, help to make make things go a little smoother, a little bit better for our kids and for our staff this, these first couple of days. At Audiology Associates of Prestonsburg, you can live your life the way you want and find the freedom of better hearing. With 40 years of being in the hearing care industry, you'll experience patient care that is specific to you with exceptional follow-up care that ensures your hearing and balance needs are being met. Audiology Associates at 1428 North Lake Drive in Prestonsburg. Faculty and students across the district dressed in black to express their grief. There will be no school for John M. Stumbo during the memorial service. We're wearing black today at our school. Our eighth grade class came up with that. Her, her, she had eighth grade as a homeroom class, so uh, the students reached out to us over the weekend and wanted to wear black in uh, honor of her and in remembrance, and the whole district decided to pick up on that. So our entire uh, school system, Floyd County uh, School District, is wearing black today. and. Um, um, obviously, we're, um, I've spoken with the family members and we're going to um, not have school on the day of the memorial service so that our faculty and staff and students can attend. Um, it's just a, a tough time when you lose some, someone that's such an integral part of, of your building and has um, solid relationships with your kids and staff. It, it, it makes it, it's, it's just a hard time. It, it hurts really deep. Reporting for Mountaintop News, I'm Nick Collum.